Hello, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to uh, invite you to today's presentation. Uh, we are going to talk about a similar topic as uh, the last group, um, and that is what to do with uh, labels from uh, beer bottles. Uh, the participants that had worked on this uh, project were Alexei, Fabian, Rebecca, and Chingis, and me. <coughs> Um, as for the images, we can see the first image is of the pivovar, of the brewery, and the other one is basically the first time when the labels see the day of the light. Uh, for the overview, we are going to go through technologies that we uh, have considered, uh, the problems we have faced, and the conclusion. <laughs> Uh, among the first technology uh, and the main one that we decided upon is a long-term solution and that is to uh, print the labels on the bottles itself. Uh, as you can see on the image, it's quite fashionable and it also is pretty creative and I think it, there is market for it. Uh, as the bottle te print technology evolves, it will become more affordable and it will create, as I said, visually appealing images and uh, labels. Uh, the companies, one of the companies that here we have found is Moravia Decor uh, and it's located in Zlin. Among the benefits, we have high quality images, uh, the dur durability is higher and it's also going to be resistant to scratches. So that's a good benefit. Uh, the second, our solution, it's a process of uh, conversion from salt materials to, for example, gas, it's called pyrosis. It's a very eco-friendly uh, process from 20 to uh, 130 tons of paper we can uh, Take, produce a, approximately uh, 56,000 of um, cubic meters of gas mix. Uh, for this, we have two ways. First, it's outsourcing. We will send uh, paper to another company and receive uh, gas mix. And second, it's own uh, process plant. It's a little bit harder, but more efficiency and more saved money. Despite its numerous benefits, the recycling paper through the pyrolysis have uh, the challenges and the problems. And one major, major challenge is the implementation of the process on the large scale. The equipment for the pyrolysis is very expensive. And the process itself uh, requires a uh, huge amount of energy. And another problem is, like we know, the waste is consists of paper, water, and the most important is glue. And the glue can affect on the efficiency of the process. <clears throat> okay, so we understand that going to zero waste and bottle printing takes time. So we've came up we've came up with yet another solution, which is to sell this waste to a waste managing company, which is located in Uhrineves. It's 20 kilometers from Prague, and they can provide their own uh, transportation which can take up to six tons of this material in one ride. It costs uh, approximately 3,000 crowns, uh, one ride. And the purchase price of this paper material is 1.5 crown per kilogram, which is in grand total, grand total approximately 350,000 crowns per 230 tons of waste and this company even offers uh, more uh, interesting prices for business customers and 
it's by our uh, we think this is a very simple and elegant solution uh, for this problem so in the conclusion bottle print is complete elimination of the waste Pyrolysis is reusage of waste to gain energy and the waste managing company immediate solution with profit while transiting to zero waste. But we recommend you to use the bottle print technology because the pyrolysis have the problems that I told you before and the waste managing company is uh, not the long term solution. So we recommend at first to use the pyrolysis um, with partnership uh, with a company like Millennium, yes, and it can help you to avoid the problems with the pyrolysis in the start. And while the while you do the pyrolysis, uh, you need to start to install the bottle print technology on your brewery. And when the installing is done, with time, uh, the bottle print technology can reduce the amount of waste by 100%. So, thank you for your attention. <laughs> it's a real closing sentence, right? Now you can reduce your waste by 100%. Are there any questions about this? So, uh, maybe one. Good afternoon. Uh, you mentioned that bottle printing is the most preferable option uh, but uh, for the bottle and uh, on each label, there must be some some st uh, strict information and identification of uh, beer uh, production. Mm -hmm. So there is no mm, two same bottles. Uh, yeah. So and it means that uh, one bottle uh, can be uh, used for let's say Kozel brand and uh, wash them and use for the Gambrinus brand. So uh, these two things must be taken into account. And I'm, I'm a little bit doubtful about the printing technology um, for for beer, beer bottle. So I, I can't see the way of doing it. Uh, but uh, for the paralyzer, so yeah, it's good could work, so it's definitely an option. And uh, you speaking about me a mega, uh, mega company, and it's definitely the option. Yeah. I have maybe one question uh, about the printing butler. Is uh, you are considering uh, returnable butlers or is uh, one way because uh, is uh, printing uh, picture and design butler washable? Um, yes, it's washable. It's washable. Be then, uh, of course, it's also a solution, but uh, yeah, I can't. Uh, because uh, definitely, what Tomáš mentioned, we have to print the legislative text, yeah, which is a mandatory points for the pro uh, selling uh, the product to the market. And of course, on the opposite side, uh, Butler is uh, is a place for the brand and for the summer promo activity and for the for the message to the to the customer. That uh, okay, it's very very interesting. Also for to, to printing uh, and maybe it's a space for the customizing of the brand and uh, really quickly change uh, the 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 promo uh, picture for the for the customer, etc. Pyrolysis, uh, yeah, I also love it uh, because uh, it's uh, the secondly usable material for the really eco ecology uh, uh, technology we're using. And uh, the third part, yes, we are, we are, I think I know who is the, the company who we'll talk about. Yeah, I know it. Uh, you you thought that it's a short solution, and I don't know what's the next step of this company. What's uh, what's uh, is uh, their next uh, um, behavior with the waste? What they are using with uh, the ore waste as a second uh, second step? Yeah. Do you know it or not? Uh, we don't know. You don't know. Sorry. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Thank you.
<laughs> Are there any other questions from the audience or the jury members? If not, then um, thank you very maybe, much for maybe, your presentation. Maybe I would have a question. Yes. Um, that's, that's me, but I'm lazy to go down. Um, so maybe... Breakable, more breakable. Could it be dangerous that it breaks more easily, thus uh, hurting people, customers? No, no, it no, no, should no. not be. It should not be. It basically should be cheaper because there is uh, no paper involved in the process of printing on bottle. But it's harder to print on the bottle, and then uh, you have to print a lot of small things with a lot of precision to, like, you know, as they say, they have like own IP and like I guess paper mark and lots of stuff. So it, it has to be precise, I think. And then I was just wondering whether it was actually expensive or cheaper. So at first it will it may be more like expensive because you need to install the technology but with time of course it will be cheaper because you need to care about the waste of course and uh, you don't like buy the paper and the thing you have like the technology the machines they do it and so it will be cheaper with time of course Yes, question, please. Well, this company has capacity of up to 60 million bottles per year of printing, 60 million bottles per year, so I don't think that should be a problem. Printing. Well, sure, they can come up. Can, then um, they can come up with different designs, but uh, actual designs which are currently used can be also used because the color range of print is wide, and it shouldn't be a problem. Okay, thank you very much. Also, for questions from your colleague students, excellent. So, thank you very much for your presentation. Thank you, too. Thank you.